Hi, my name is Roberto Arduna. I'm running for uh, Ward 3, District 4. I'm inviting you to please come out and vote on September the 13th at the Democratic uh, primaries. I'm a lifelong resident of the city of Newburgh. I'm actually uh, advocating for safer streets so we have a better community and actually better schools for all of our kids. So please come out and vote on, this, on the 13th. Newburgh, September 13th. You need to come out and vote. You need to vote for new members of the Democratic Committee for the City of Newburgh. Please, we're asking you to come out on September 13th and vote. Vote for your particular candidates in your ward and district. We're looking for your support. Make your voice be heard. There is power in your vote. Hi, I'm Lisa Daly. I've been living in Newburgh for over 40 years. I represent District 4-2, which is by Mount St. Mary College. I've been on the planning board for over 30 years and recently have become chairman of the Land Bank. I really love what's happening in the city of Newburgh. I think there are many, many special things happening and it's exciting. And what I want to see with this new committee restructuring with the Democratic Committee is to get more people, new people, old people, people who haven't been interested, people who are showing an interest, to come and join us in an inclusive way. I'm Dr. Benilda Armstead-Jones, and I'm doing what I feel is something of most importance, and that is to serve the community of Newburgh. The uh, chair of the committee is one of the most manipulative divisive individuals I've ever met. Um, totally cunning. He is um, not uh, a way maker, but there for the process. And the process is to vote. Um, I'm not looking for any office or anything like that. It takes my time. And everybody else, everybody else is talking to come out and deal with the committee. The committee is the first rung in the process. It's the board, if you will, of directors in terms of our party, which is the Democratic Party. Hi, my name is Lillian Bordarelli, and I'm a resident of Newburgh for about 11 years. I am a mother of two children that attend the Newburgh City School District I am also a member of the parent-teacher committee at their school, and for a little over a year, I was a City of Newburgh employee. My position was the City Administ uh, Assistant to the City Manager, Michael Carabino. The um, effort and the work and the hours that he puts in to improve the city is amazing. Um, he's brought new blood, new employees to the city, with new ideas that we're working hard to make our city better. The water superintendent, the chief of police, who day after day continues to improve the city and make it safe for our children. I believe that you need to come out on September 13th and vote for the new people that are willing to support our changes, to support the new energy this, that is rising and to support our leadership. Michael Caravino and some of the members of council. So please, come out and vote. My name is Mary Ellen Kuczynski. I've lived in the city of Newburgh for over 40 years, and before that I lived in the town of Newburgh. I taught for a long time in the Newburgh district, and I'm running for the city democratic committee in a very small district, 4-1, near the armory and the activity center. I spend much time at the uh, armory, where I am the volunteer librarian, and one of the reasons I'm running for the committee is that I really hope that we can incorporate many different neighborhoods into participation in government here and to give all the children that we serve at the Army a brighter future. Thanks. Hope you'll vote for us. My name is Mark Carnes. I'm running for the Democratic Committee for Ward 1, District 3, and uh, that's the Upper Liberty Street and North Street. I'm running for the committee because I'd like to bring more people into the committee as a leadership forum to eventually help recruit new leaders for the city council and for leaders locally. So I hope you come out to vote. Thanks. Hi, my name is Bob Scalars. I live in the West End, uh, in the city of Newburgh. Uh, I've lived there for 30 years. I've been a Newburgh resident for 44 years. Most of that time I've uh, 
work in human resources management, where I was heavily involved in recruitment and selection of professionals. I think I can bring some of those skills to the city of Newburgh to help uh, improve its leadership. Hi, my name is Nadine Gray Spear, and I'm running for the Democratic Committee in the Heights. And what I want for Newburgh is simple. I want it to be clean, I want it to be safe, and I want our politicians to work for us, not some political bosses. It's time for Jonathan to move on and do something constructive for this city and not cause all the havoc that's been caused on, on that committee. The committee is toxic. He gets the proxy. He doesn't care if you're there or not. You'll get your proxy and he'll use the proxy to get what he wants accomplished. What his thoughts are, what his, what his initiatives are, what his desires are, just give him the proxy. He doesn't care if you show up or not. He'll get that paper. He works it. He works it. He will get, you know, you don't come. He just give him that proxy to do with as he sees fit. I see myself as not just a proxy for anyone. And I am determined not to be bullied. I don't like bullies. I believe in the process. And I'm here to take on my, what I feel is my civic responsibility. And that is to run for the City of Newburgh's Democratic uh, Committee. So folk that are not sincere and are just in it to whatever, you know, say I've taken pictures with just about everybody. I'm, you know, a big deal. Everybody knows me. Yeah, know you for what? Uh, know you to be cunning, divisive, dividing everyone, uh, accepting those that have their own agendas, that um, birds of a feather flock together. Like minds, fresh wind, fresh fresh fire, a new a new day in town.